So you're diving into the world of extended fasting. You've heard about autophagy, that incredible cellular cleanup process, and you're ready to hit the reset button on your body. But there's one crucial piece of the puzzle that often gets overlooked, and ignoring it can turn your health journey into a nightmare. I'm talking about electrolytes. Think of it this way. Your body is like a high-performance electric car, and your cells are the intricate wiring. Electrolytes, minerals like sodium, potassium, and magnesium, are the electrical charge that keeps everything running. They manage your nerve signals, muscle contractions, and most importantly for fasting, your hydration levels. Now, when you stop eating, your insulin levels plummet. This is great for fat burning, but it also signals your kidneys to flush out sodium and water like crazy. You're not just losing water weight, you're losing critical minerals. This is why people on day two or three of a fast suddenly feel awful. They get hit with headaches, dizziness, muscle cramps, and heart palpitations. That's not your body detoxing in a bad way. That's your body screaming for electrolytes. It's the dreaded keto flu, but for fasters. Ignoring this can be genuinely dangerous. A severe imbalance can mess with your heart rhythm and blood pressure. We're fasting for health, not to end up in the emergency room, right? So how do you keep your cells happy and your body humming along during this powerful process of autophagy? You supplement. But please, do not just chug a commercial sports drink. Those are often packed with sugar which will completely break your fast and defeat the entire purpose. You need a clean, zero-calorie solution. And luckily, it's super easy and cheap to make at home. I call this my fasting fuel. Get ready to write this down. Grab a big bottle of water, say one liter or about 32 ounces. To this, you're going to add first sodium. We need about a quarter to a half teaspoon of good quality salt. Pink Himalayan or Celtic sea salt are fantastic because they contain trace minerals. Second, potassium. This is the other side of the sodium-potassium pump, crucial for your heart. Get some no-salt or a similar salt substitute from the grocery store. It's just potassium chloride. Add about a quarter teaspoon. Third, magnesium. This is the relaxation mineral, great for preventing cramps and helping you sleep. You can add a squirt of liquid magnesium citrate or simply take a magnesium glycinate capsule on the side, as it doesn't always dissolve well. Give that bottle a good shake and you've got your electrolyte-rich fasting support drink. Sip this throughout the day. Don't chug it all at once or you might find yourself running to the bathroom for a different reason. Listen to your body. If you feel dizzy or get a headache, have a few sips. If you're exercising, you'll need more. This simple recipe is the secret to unlocking a smooth, energized, and effective extended fast. It allows you to reap all the benefits of autophagy without the debilitating side effects. So fast smart. Stay hydrated and keep those electrolytes in balance. Your cells will thank you for it.